So even though it is New Year's, you can still find reasonable accommodations for a reasonable price in Puerto Vallarta. This behind us is Hotel Encino. Encino, Encino Hotel, <laughs> which is very close to the area, to the down to the Malecon and to the Rio Cual. Yes, it's super, super close, super close to everything, easy to walk. Um, so let's go check it out inside. has a nice uh, terrace here and we have a nice view too. There's a nice view over here. We'll spin around. The Rio Cualito is very close. The river is right down here behind us. And there's a pool. Although I don't know that I would want to use it. It's <laughs> over Not here. Very... It looks a bit dirty. Hey guys, how are you? We're here in Puerto Vallarta and today we're going to be dining at one of my favorite small restaurants. It's very inexpensive, so let's go. Let's go. So this was one of my favorite places to come to have breakfast. Uh, when I used to live here in Puerto Vallarta. I lived here in El Centro, just up the hill over here. You can see it. I'll, we'll show you, uh, I'll show you later kind of where that leads up to. There's a nice walking area up there. But this restaurant is inexpensive and you can get all kinds of things here. Yeah, the name is La Tostaderia and you can order um, omelets, machaca, chilaquiles, and very nice coffee. So I'm gonna have machaca today. That's one of my favorite Mexican breakfasts. Machaca is kind of like a dried I... beef mixed with egg. I'll show it to you when it comes. And I always order chilaquiles I with chilaquiles. Always order chilaquiles. <laughs> I love them guys. You should try. Chilaquiles, if you haven't had chilaquiles, they're like um, chips, tostadas, <clears throat> that are covered in a sauce. So uh, it's kind of an odd breakfast thing, but <laughs> it's very popular here in Mexico. Very Mexican. Very Mexican. So one, once those come out, we ordered them. The chilaquiles are, and both, and the chaca are both only about, uh, five dollars less than five dollars so uh, it comes with coffee some orange juice always fresh squeezed um yeah so don't miss this place guys yeah don't miss this one this one's a nice place uh, we'll we'll put up a little map show you where it's at in central so my orange juice has come out this fresh squeezed orange juice 35 pesos which is like Less than two dollars, dollar eight. Yeah. So, this is one of the best things about Puerto Vallarta: is all of the vegetables and the fruits and the. It's, it's just so inexpensive. It really, and fresh. And fresh, relative to what what we're used to. So, cheers, salute. Salud, amigos. It's here. So here we go. We have. We have our chilaquiles with two fried eggs, <laughs> some refried beans. Very nice portion. And over here we have machaca, which is that uh, dried beef with eggs. We have some salsas. And I'm starving. Me too. 
So we've just finished eating and it was as good as I remember. What did you think? It was your first time it here. It was my first time here and the portion are really good and the flavor was amazing. You should try guys. Yeah, I'm stuffed. And the whole the whole breakfast was 263 pesos. That's $13. I mean, you can't beat it. Very cheap. Very inexpensive. Uh, got everything I need, and now we need to do a little bit of walking to walk off this break. You want to join us? Let's go. So we're going to make a little walk up here. We're going to walk up behind a restaurant, go up to where I used to live, where there's a nice mirror door where we can have a nice lookout. So. And also there is a lot of stairs so you can work out. Yes, you can get your workout. You can yeah. burn <laughs> off. You can burn off all that delicious food that you just ate. It's a little bit of a walk to get up here, but not too bad. And the view it's is amazing. spectacular. Yeah. It's definitely <laughs> worth being up here. Don't forget to bring your sunscreen and your hat because it's very sunny. So as we were leaving the Mirador, we came across just this other street, just one block down in between the cobblestones streets you can just find all of these beautiful pathways these beautiful manicured pathways with all these beautiful places where you can just come relax feel free to sit down have a snack and get out of the sun into this beautiful shade and enjoy the beautifulness of Puerto Vallarta So after a nice hot walk in the sun, even though it is December here, well, it's hot for me. <laughs> it's, it's normal for me. So a good ice cream would be perfect. So we're coming here to Licks, which is an ice cream store here on the Malacon. And let's go see what they have. Very delicious. What flavor? Limon sorbet. Mmm, delicious. <laughs> No, look here on mine. Which flavor? We've got cocoa, coconut, and Belgian chocolate brown. Very dumb. So finally we have our ice cream. It's delicious. And they have so many flavors, basically anything you could think of, they're going to have that flavor. Today, one of their special flavors is maple bacon. I mean, maple bacon ice cream. <laughs> you can't go wrong with that. The total for, I got two scoops. I have two. In a cone. In, in a cone. It was 135 pesos, which is what, about $6.25 or so. So we had two giant things, about $3 each. Perfect for beating me. Hola amigos, well, we are checking out early. 
because we have some issues in this hotel. It was nice if you're gonna spend most of the time outside exploring the city, but yeah, we decided that we wanna leave. <laughs> yeah, it, I mean, this hotel is okay. I mean, it was like we were doing it on the cheap um, and it, it's an inexpensive hotel. Uh, like I said, only cost us around $50 a night, but a couple of problems. The internet is really bad in the rooms. Um, Elevator was also broken and we are on the third floor, so it was so hard. The elevator, stairs, like. the elevator <laughs> broke three days ago and they kept saying, it'll be fixed tomorrow, tomorrow. it'll be fixed tomorrow. Uh, not a huge deal, but just uh, overall, um, we were just looking forward to having one nice night somewhere <laughs> in a in a little bit better hotel. So so we're gonna move up the road a little bit. Um, but please, if you enjoyed this video, if please like the video, please subscribe, subscribe. to our channel. Uh, we're going to be putting up videos every week about our travels and about other things uh, going on in our lives, like. Uh, sit lolly's visa process so uh subscribe to our channel and um we'll see you next time and leave us some comments if you want to say something yeah like please leave some comments uh, let mm -hmm. us know how we're doing and uh we'll respond too